2022 Lunar event. This event is a huge letdown this year. Everything is harder, everything is recolored. The vanities look like chef vanities as if you're wearing culinary sets. It literally looks like an apron. The badges do not even fit the character. The only good badge is the rabbit badge. I don't see anyone wearing it right now. But um, yeah, the rabbit badge is a good badge. It looks decent. The envelope badge, I can say the opposite of. The envelope badge is a really bad badge to get. It looks ugly. Like, it doesn't even fit anything on your character. It just looks like it's a side character to your character. It honestly does. If you see anyone with it, you will notice what I'm saying. But let's start off with the elixir. So you get a 25,000 gold elixir. This elixir is 25k for 10 minutes. You snap your fingers and 10 minutes is gone. Last year, in the previous years, it was 5,000 gold for f one hour. That's a big difference compared to this year. The next thing is just a meme, like an actual joke. Literally a complete joke this is. 200 envelopes for 100 platinum. 100 platinum is worth 6 million gold. What in the hell makes these developers think that 200 envelopes is worth 6 million gold? Because it's not. This banner, if I remember correctly, it's just a recolor. Well, not even a recolor. It's just a redesign of the banner from last year, if I'm if I'm correct. I remember a banner like this in the game. I can't remember where it's from. Probably from a previous Lunar year. Um, or I just might be tripping. But I remember a banner like this in the past. Armor. Of course, your little apron. Little metal apron you're wearing. If you get any t anything wet on it. You're going to rust it out, so you can't even cook with it. Your pet. The pet is useless. The ha passive bonus is what people might possibly use, but everything else, no one's going to use it because 100% dodge on the arcane ability. I have 200% dodge on my rogue. I get hit pretty often by mobs. The dodge cap is 70%, so 100% with useless. The New Year badge, of course, is what the only thing it's worth farming for. There's nothing else worth farming for in this event. The recipes for the auras are paperweights if you do not have the aura to upgrade. You have to have the aura to use the recipe to upgrade it to the deluxe aura. If you don't have that, then this is a paperweight in your inventory. Don't buy it. Recipe for the ring. If you plan to craft the ring, buy this. But... I would prefer you to stick with Profiteer. Profiteer is better than the Arcane Ring. Funny, a Mythic Ring that's lower level is better than an Arcane Ring that is higher level. I don't know if it is higher level or not. I'm actually going to check right now. Yeah, level 81. Profiteer Ring is better. The reason it's better is because it gives 20 elite damage. You're farming elite sunken all day long. You do more damage. 15% gold loot, no one's going to use gold loot on the ring, everyone has venal sets because of the drop rates of venal and stuff like that in the winter event. People were mad at me because I was like, uh, that's stupid that they're releasing so many sets, but guess who's laughing now? Well, I'm not laughing. You're not laughing. The maps were nerfed. I wish I could be laughing, but I can't. Um, the next item is going to be... The recipe for the heroic pet, which is also useless, unless if you want to use its passive, but there are cheaper options. And then, the crackle bombs. These fireworks are the price of crack in real life. Literally. I go to the auction, I type in crack. It's 3,000 gold for one firework. I know, 3,000 gold, oh, 3,000 gold, that's not a lot. But what's 3,000 times 1,000? That's 3 million. That's a huge difference. Last year, it was like 600 gold to 1,000 gold for a firework. And this price increase is going to make it to where people are not going to open fireworks as much as last year or the previous years, which sucks. Because, I mean, Lunar Year, it's fireworks. And since the prices are high, we can't really open them. Most of us are going to refuse to because mentally it sucks to spend 3 million gold just for something that's going to last for maybe a minute. So yeah, this event... I hate to bring it down, but they didn't put any work into it. Like, literally look at this pet. 
this uh, Kawhi pet. I don't even know if that's pronounced cor uh, correctly. But it looks like it's been like extracted from Pocket Legends and put into Arcane Legends. The uh, the um, logos on it, the sun logo thingy, the bright red color, the bright white sword, the golden bright vest. It's just a Pocket Legend rabbit. It's what it looks like. If I, I bet if I log into Pocket Legends, that rabbit is in the game. They... They did, They probably didn't even recolor the... Yeah, they did recolor it. You see this black rabbit here? Look at here. Uh, Hero Carry. See Hero Carry? That's what it looks like. Well, that's normal Harry, but heroic. And then I zoom in on this rabbit. Guess who it looks like? It looks like Harry. They recolored it. This is Zulong. Zulong the dragon with a hat. That's green. I wonder how many Zulongs we're gonna get. We already have like five of them. Let's see, if I go through this list, here's one of them. Puzzlong, um, Lucia, the new dragon, which is useless because no one's gonna use this. There's no percent damage. No one uses health um, bonus unless if you're using like, what's it called? Uh, it's a mythic pet. It is called Baby Blizzarax. No one's going to use any health pet other than that one, or Leto. So, Lucia is a second dragon. And then you have Shenlong, which is a third dragon. And then you have Yinchi, which is a fourth dragon. And then you have Zulong, which is a fifth dragon, McDonald's Fry Dragon. How many dragons are we going to get? It's recolored. I mean, it really sucks. They put out a letter saying that this year is going to be a whole new year, it's going to be so good. But this event is a huge letdown. I haven't even been online to farm, I've been playing Minecraft. That's what I've been doing. So anyways, good luck with this event if you plan to run it. If you plan to run it, the only thing you're really going to do is get the badge with the tokens. So if you're looking for gold, steer away from this event, go to Elite Sunken or something.